Ever found yourself clutching your chest after a hearty meal, wishing you hadn't indulged in that extra slice of pizza? You're experiencing what many call acid reflux, a rather uncomfortable, sometimes painful condition that affects millions across the globe each year. Acid reflux, or gastroesophageal reflux disease, occurs when stomach acid makes its way back up into the esophagus, leading to symptoms like heartburn, a burning sensation in the chest, and regurgitation of food or sour liquid. Understanding how to manage these symptoms is crucial, and it begins with knowing how medications like ranitidine work to alleviate the discomfort. Ranitidine, a popular choice among both doctors and patients, targets the root of the problem by reducing the amount of acid your stomach produces. This not only helps soothe the burning sensation, but also aids in preventing the acid from traveling back up the esophagus. If these troubles sound familiar, you're not alone. But how exactly does a tablet ease this fiery ordeal? Let's unravel the science behind ranitidine. Ranitidine, often known by its brand name, has been a beacon of relief for acid reflux sufferers. But what exactly is ranitidine? This medication falls under the category of H2 blockers, a class of drugs that have a specific target, histamine type 2 receptors on stomach cells. By blocking these receptors, ranitidine effectively reduces the amount of acid these cells produce. Primarily, ranitidine is used to treat a spectrum of conditions where stomach acid becomes a culprit. This includes peptic ulcers, gastroesophageal reflux disease, or GERD, and conditions like Zollinger-Ellison syndrome, which involve excessive acid production. Its ability to mitigate acid production makes it a valuable tool in the medical arsenal against these disorders. Available in various forms, ranitidine can be found as tablets, capsules, and even a liquid solution, catering to different needs and preferences of patients. This flexibility in administration helps ensure that those in need can access its benefits in a form that suits them best. Now, Knowing what ranitidine is sets the perfect groundwork to explore how it tames the acid in your stomach. Imagine your stomach as a battleground where excess acid is the enemy and ranitidine the hero. Ranitidine, a molecule of seemingly modest structure, holds profound prowess in this battle. Its chemical name, n 2 furan 2 ethyl n methyl 2 nitroethene one one diamine might sound daunting, but its function is crucial. It belongs to a class of drugs known as H2 receptor antagonists. These are essentially the peacekeepers in the acidic environment of your stomach. But how does ranitidine achieve this? It targets the histamine H2 receptors, which are found on the surface of stomach cells called parietal cells. These cells are the acid factories of your stomach. Under normal circumstances, when stimulated by the naturally occurring chemical histamine, these receptors trigger the production of stomach acid. However, when ranitidine enters the fray, it blocks these receptors. By binding to the H2 receptors, ranitidine prevents histamine from attaching to them. This blockage is akin to putting a lock on the acid production line. It can't start because the key is missing. As a result, the overall secretion of stomach acid is reduced. This doesn't mean that all acid production stops but it decreases to a level that is more manageable and less harmful to the stomach lining. The reduction in acid production leads to a significant decrease in the overall acidity of the stomach. This is crucial for individuals suffering from conditions like acid reflux, where the lower esophageal sphincter fails to prevent the stomach contents from rising back up into the esophagus. By lowering the acid levels, ranetidine helps prevent the irritation and burning sensation often associated with acid reflux also known as heartburn. With the enemy subdued, the symptoms of acid reflux retreat. But what does this mean for your body over time? Lowering stomach acid might sound like a minor victory, but the implications are vast. Imagine a world where acid reflux isn't just an annoying interruption to your daily life, but a manageable condition. That's where ranitidine comes into play, serving as a beacon of relief for millions. Ranitidine, by reducing the production of stomach acid, offers immediate relief from the burning sensation often associated with acid reflux and heartburn. This isn't just about comfort, although that certainly isn't a minor point. The reduction of acid means less irritation and damage to the esophagus. Over time, untreated acid reflux can lead to more serious conditions, including esophageal cancer. By stepping in early with ranitidine, we can prevent these severe outcomes 
preserving both health and well-being. Furthermore, the impact of vernetidine extends to overall quality of life. Imagine being able to enjoy a meal without the looming threat of discomfort and pain that acid reflux brings. For those who have suffered long-term, the psychological boost from managing these symptoms effectively cannot be overstated. It means better sleep, no need to avoid social meals, and a return to normalcy. However, it's important to tailor the dosage of ranetidine to the individual's specific needs. The severity and type of acid reflux or heartburn can vary widely, and so too should the approach to treatment. A healthcare provider can determine the right dosage to maximize benefits while minimizing any potential risks. Speaking of risks, while ranetidine is generally safe, it's not without its side effects. Some individuals might experience headaches, dizziness, or constipation, and in rare cases, more severe reactions. It's crucial to be aware of these and discuss them with a healthcare provider, ensuring that the treatment plan remains the best course of action. Thus, ranitidine not only quenches the flames of acid reflux, but also shields your body from potential long-term harm. This isn't just about suppressing stomach acid, it's about restoring quality of life and preventing future health complications. So we've journeyed through the hows and whys of ranitidine's battle against stomach acid. Let's distill our understanding of its pivotal role in managing acid-related discomfort. Ranetidine functions as an H2 blocker, a type of medication that targets and blocks histamine type 2 receptors on the stomach's parietal cells. These cells are primarily responsible for secreting hydrochloric acid. By blocking these receptors, ranetidine effectively reduces the amount of acid these cells release, leading to less irritation of the stomach lining and esophagus. This mechanism is particularly beneficial for treating conditions like gastroesophageal reflux disease, peptic ulcers, and Zollinger-Ellison syndrome, where excess stomach acid is a frequent culprit. Understanding how ranetidine works not only demystifies the process of acid regulation, but also empowers individuals, especially those in the medical field, to make more informed decisions about their health management. Next time that wave of heartburn hits, you'll know exactly how the remedy at your fingertips works. Knowledge, indeed, is comforting.